Howdy all you delicious people. I'm here today to play more Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutant Madness. You you like how I was really like doing a ghost story thing there? I uh, <laughs> uh down below I am uh editing. I say editing because I'm not really doing much of anything. I'm just waiting for uh something to process. Uh but yeah, uh, it's making me a little bit brighter than you, than normal. So Doing that, and then, uh, because I also am decompressing from uh, a two-hour review of The Tick Season 1, and then I am, after that, after this thing processes, I am going to hopefully be reviewing the pilot episode of The Punisher, I hope. So, uh, it all depends on if I have, uh, the time to do that, to fuse that, to, to, if I have the energy left to all that so i know the stuff that i probably just mentioned isn't really much of halloween like stuff but f it uh i'm gonna do i'm gonna probably put out this today because this is like an everyday series hopefully uh gonna go out of my way to beat uh take down just accomplish uh taken down and out this level so i hope for the best within the wrongs of that with my life i'll get to that later uh i'll watch an ad to get that to get those resources because i'm not really close to uppity uh uppity some of my guys or get a three-star character not up to that yet. <sighs> Just two hours of, of, of chatting it out today. So I'm feeling froggy. I'm feeling fresh. Uh, feeling a bit of Magoo, if you know what I say. No. <laughs> it's okay. It's all good in the hood. So, uh, let's get April out there. Let's dust her off. Let's see what happens. Where what where is Casey at? He's at fifty. Uh, slash is at sixty. Let's see what happens. We're trying to go through different rosters, different kind of characters to see if we can beat this level. Uh, because it is fairly complicated. It is a uh, really challenging level. So uh, we're hoping. Uh, that things are going to change and we're going to start taking down. We're going to take out, hopefully, within this within this time around. Because, good grief. Uh, I don't know how many numerous times I have, like, one guy left and four enemies. So, hopefully, we can just turn this around, please. Desperately, please. <laughs> Let this be the one. Let this be the one, please. Because my guys are almost dead. They're almost dead. They are. <laughs> come on. Come on. Come on. No, 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 no. Not that. No. Really? There was one time I came pretty dang close. I just had rock. I think I had like rock city, I think, left. And I was like, oh my god. I am just. Mmm. And no. I got defeated because you like you think you're so I think I had like two turtles left too and I was like this is the time this is the moment and then no it's so mmm these levels they make you just want to go mmm want to go mmm mmm see what happens when I put this character in let's just see because I don't know. I am just uh, looking at a bag of cats going meow. That's what I'm doing. I'm looking and I'm seeing. I'm lingering. Uh, come on. Give me, give me, give me some of that. Give me, the, give me some of that sweet stuff. Give me some of that, that good time. Give me some of that sweet, delicious something. There is no nothing coming out of 
there is nothing being done with this character. Come on, take him out, take him down. <laughs> please, please, please. <laughs> Do it! <laughs> Do it! <laughs> this time! It's... Oh! Did anybody see that? Oh, well, I recorded it. Oh, my gosh. Ah, uh, oh, my... This took so long. It was such a long time coming. It was a long road. Whew. God, I hate these hard levels because they take like two days to try to beat. But that is the best thing is when you're just bizarrely looking for combinations of certain characters. And then all of a sudden just something freaking finally just works. It makes you feel good. It makes you feel like, mm, yeah, I just did a little in my in my in my good time. Just a little, and everybody was laughing, and it was all good. It's like, yeah. Whoo, yeah. A boatload of whoo going on, too, because, yeah. Two hours of reviewing the tick, and having all those details popping out of that review, huh, was just like, man, this is rough. Rough justice. Uh, just... Win a PvP battle. Oh, it's giving me rewards? It's giving me those sweet, delicious rewards? What am I even doing with my life? I am building an increased hero power? What does that even mean in my life? Um, multiplies the power value of your heroes. Oh, wait a minute. A dojo? Oh, increasing my power because, again, my characters aren't really that powerful enough. <laughs> Evidently, that they're getting freaking clocked, even though Mikey is, like, he's, like, 90-something level. That doesn't matter to you. <laughs> that doesn't matter to you. Ah, uh, that sweet, delicious ping and pong in of, of, of things going on here. Uh, so wait, so what does that mean, though? Because with that increase, with this increase, I should know how this affects my characters. So what does this exactly mean? Because it says multiplies the power value of your heroes. So... Is there a way to, to... How, how, how will understand that stat? How does that affect my character? Because, uh, what is, what is love? Baby, don't hurt me no more? Because I, what does that mean? Uh. <laughs> you guys remember the movie Night of the Roxbury? Or any of the stuff they did, they did on Saturday Night Live? Using that song every day of our lives? Whoo, Yeah. That felt like a boatload of good right there. Ah, uh, just every day I'm hustling. That's what I'm doing this game. Just hustling my way to get a little bit of a, a little bit of that green or that or that blue. Come on, really? Here, here's my problem right here. The rewards available screen thing. Good God, how many times have I accidentally during this playthrough, accidentally? Hit that thing and then hit it off. <laughs> God, uh, to collect this. How many numerous times is that going to be a mistake in my life? Uh, true friendship, only 7 out of 10? Uh, just 
reunited and it feels so good with beating a level. Whew. Just, whew. Feeling fresh. I feel like Cobra Kai right now. Daniel Sun. Yeah, I'm gonna get my fisticuffs in there. And my, my big hairy fists of fury. Because, yeah. You've seen some of the thumbnails. You would know. Like, this dude is a werewolf. <laughs> 2411. You don't need a, a you don't need to have me see a full moon to be all like grizzly and stuff. I'm like Hugh Jackman. Not not that attractive, but you know what I mean. Like that guy, hair. Me hair. <laughs> hair. I am a werewolf. I am a werewolf. Not a werewolf, I'm a werewolf. Which I don't even know what that means. So, uh, I guess, uh, I should just change my, uh, my YouTube name now to Werewolf Griffin. Yeah, that's, that's, that's who I am now. That's who my moniker should be for this episode and this episode alone. I don't know how you spell Werewolf, but if anybody wants to try it, give it a, give it a good try. Because I, I, I won't tell you, I won't, I won't, I don't know how to spell it. Oh my Christmas, am I getting something early? Another hero drive? Yeah, I just did one a little bit ago and I got like a Donatello as my finger is not a mustache. Uh, what are we gonna get now? Another Donatello. Wow, we get double the Donny, double the fun. Cause his name is Donny. Uh. 107, new record. Everybody feeling good? I feel good. That I beat that level. I looked at it and I'm like... <laughs> uh, there, There is like one uh, really funny episode of, uh, of this one series where uh, supposedly this character... I think it's still up. Um, Dangerous Fellows. Or something like that. It was something about a... It was like... It was a zombie series that I did. And it's it's still up. Probably. Dangerous Fellows. Yeah. Uh, where I had this one character. And all he would do... Uh, when I would have to read his dialogue. Every single thing that he would do was just... He would just nod. And basically... So I'd have to read the word nod. A lot. And so like... I would just start to make fun of this guy. Because I was starting to get really annoyed to waste the time to have to say the word nod a lot. So I'm just like, uh-huh, so this guy, he's doing one of these. <laughs> like, I would, I would extremely exaggerate this guy's nodding whenever it would happen in this story because I was just like, you know what, I gotta, I gotta take a mile out of this, out of this little thing and just make it a big thing. Like, that is like to me like the same uh the same kind of approach is where I would I would consistently have a person that uh wanders off in a horror movie. If you guys remember who I always call out uh in a horror movie, Steve. Steve. Steve, you have the keys, Steve. <laughs> you also have the map, Steve. <laughs> Cause there's always that guy who is stubbornly like just like well I gotta go ahead and I gotta I gotta see what that sound was and then immediately that guy never comes back for the rest of the movie until the very end and then you find out oh that guy is still alive but like he's barely alive because he was a dummy and he went first I actually love seeing him later on in the movie, and you just find out he was dead the entire movie. Oh my god, what was this? This is crazy. Oh my god. 
Just blastity blast everybody. Just do a little blastity blast. Just get a little, just get a little blastity blast. What are you gonna do with your life? That level kicked off. It did. It did with my life. I was like, and I was like, whoa. Like I felt the breeze going. Felt something flowing going on in this in this level. Did I even mention it? <sighs> Napoleon. I've I've kind of just given up on Rocksteady, uh, and or Super Irma. I apologize, but yeah, those two characters. I've given up on them. I've given I've given up on love. On, on those people. I probably shouldn't. I'm sure there's probably good uses for maybe maybe them. But in the end I'm just like. Those are probably the two best characters. And I'm just like looking at them. And I'm like. Mm. I'm about to mm with them right now. I'm not giving them the big old mm. I'm going mm. <laughs> I'm doing a boatload of these with those guys. I'm just like. Mm. Maybe one day. Uh, but not today. I'll just stubbornly just be like, well, I have every single other character uh, leveled up to a good degree. And so now I think I have to do these. And then, and by then, like, s s absurdly, like, those characters will just be like, these are the best characters in the game. What are you doing with your life? And I'm just like, I don't know. I was thinking that they were just, like, ducks. Ducks that can't swim. That's what I thought they were. Good God, what is up with all these combo platters going on? Like, what is popping off with all of this? I am so, like, off my kilter right now with all of this combo platter going on right now. This is nuts. And Michelangelo was doing a little... You see that little spinny thing Michelangelo just did? He wasn't playing, he wasn't doing the Wheel of Fortune, but he was doing the, 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 uh, nunchucks and spinning them around. As if he was, uh, like, uh, uh, Peter Vankman in the Ghostbusters, where ultimately he is mimicking what that one dancer is doing in the background, so, and bizarrely, it seems like they have both of the same red coats on. When he's talking to Sigourney Weaver and he's telling her about uh, uh, Sumerians and Babylonians. And and because she had just gotten right out of her concert with the guy with the stuffy nose. I remember this because I've seen this movie a hundred times. But uh, the guy has a cold or whatever and eventually um, Peter is like, yeah, uh... I hope, uh, I hope you're looking, uh, better, uh, better guy. You look a little pale, though. And so then eventually he just, like, spins around and copies what the dancer does because, uh, Peter asks Dana on a date and she says yes. And so he just spins around because he's weird. Uh, because ultimately he's going to give her some information, but not enough. And then he asks her, it's like, well... How about we go on that? How about we go on a date and I'll tell you more. And so that is right before when she goes home and says she's going to go on a date. And then she turns into uh, the key master when she gets sucked into uh, one of her rooms within sitting on her chair. The classic scene. Yeah. Yeah. Everyone was like, what is he even talking about? I've never seen Ghostbusters in my life. <laughs> Which is a shame, because I've seen it numerous times. I can explain that entire movie right now. And let's do it. Let's do it. Explain the entire movie. So, so Ray, Peter, and, and Egon. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. But I, I've seen that movie so many freaking many times. Ah, uh, just always good around every single holiday to bust out that movie because it basically for 
when I was a kid, it came up every single holiday. Uh, pop on to Comedy Central, and it sh it was on every holiday. Um, that was the greatest thing about Ghostbusters. Is just like, hey, you like this movie? You can see it every holiday of every year. Now, since um, since everything is streaming everything. Uh, basically we lose that luxury, but it was a good time in our lives. It was a good time. It was a good juncture in our lives. Uh, luckily I have the movie on the Blu-rays and the, the, the discs and everything, so I could still watch it every holiday. It's just... Good grief. I am just... I'm getting clapped. Eric Clapton's going on this episode. If I know my name. Da, 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 da. Old reference, I know. People are like, dude, you're throwing out so many old things. I'm this many. <laughs> I'm this many. And I don't know what you're talking about. Man, like for me. Like it was funny. Like when I was like a couple years younger than some guys. Like, and there would be this, like, huge generational gap. <laughs> like, when I would go and explain movies to somebody, or I would, I would say some bizarre reference, and they're like, where is that from? And then I would ultimately tell them, and they're like, I have never heard of that movie in my life. I'm like, are you, are you kidding me right now? Like, I would be referencing, like, Caddyshacks and... Like, Ghostbusters and all of these big, huge... It might have been a rib, but still. Uh, like, there would be so many guys where I'd be like, Yeah, this movie, it's great. And they're like, what are you even talking about? It could have been a rib. Because uh, at the end of the day, it's just like, man, Like, I don't like movie reference guy. Uh, which is completely fine. Because if anyways, like, I uh, kept to myself anyways. For most of the point, because it was just like, uh, but a lot of times you would just lose your freaking gourd through a lot of those days. So it was just like, if anything, you're just referencing just kind of any uh, random thing that popped in your brain. Um, come on, really, man, that wizard, that wizard lady. Tempestra? I don't know who she is, but I'm sure she is just a girl that is probably on a later season, probably, of, well, anything past three. Uh, I, I gotta, I, uh, I, I'm, I'm so, I'm so upset at myself, because, yeah, uh, here I am, like, mentioning, yeah, I just watched the entire season of The Tick. And then a lot of people are like, well, what about uh, season three of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles? Have you bust that out yet? Uh, I'm getting there. I'm getting there. I'm taking a, a turtle break uh, in between the times of which I'm playing this. Which is bizarre. Uh, still got to also review uh, Secret of the Ooze. I got to ooze that out. Kind of reminds me of the, the Power Rangers movie with Ivan Ooze. A whole lot of Ooze things going on. What What's up with that? What's up with, with all that Ooze going on? Monkey time, monkey time. What character do I need, game? What character do I need to beat this? Let me know, game. <laughs> Just say, you don't have it. Okay, great. That's what I thought. What I was thinking, my brain noggin. Dude, I almost had April, like, give the power move, and then she was taken away from me. She was taken. Not Liam Neeson style, but... Because she's still there. Hey, why am I all of a sudden doing better now? <laughs> In this level? What happened? What's going on here? Oh my god. Am I seriously beating this level now? <laughs> Do 
Dude, all I needed to all I needed to do was have this 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 gold axe wielding mother trucker in into these levels and I beat it. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. And he's wearing a Hawaiian shirt. Uh why? Or quasi Hawaiian? Barely Hawaiian? How is it that all of a sudden I'm adding in this guy in here? This 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 dude right here. This guy. Why is it that I add this guy and then all of a sudden I'm just Yeah, these levels? Bam. How do we get to that point? I I don't know. But luckily enough for me, uh cuz man, I need I need to to easily take down some things. When you're when you're in doubt, add add gold frog dude. He helps. He makes it away in your world today. It takes everything you got, taken away from all your worries. Yeah, I'm almost singing the cheer song. Cause again, I'm an old man. I'm an old man who has old references. Of stuff probably a lot of people are like eh. <laughs> I never watched Cheers. Is it a cartoon? No it's not. <laughs> oh come on. We are cranking away now in these levels. Yeah, gold guy, he's 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 living. He's he's gonna be living in this team forever. I am gonna beef him up. <laughs> Cause all of a sudden, out of nowhere. Yeah, we are we are we are we are keeping him. I don't know why. Why things are I guess just everybody is banging on all cylinders and they're doing attacks. That like really like take down everybody. Who yeah, feel good kind of episode. Cause I was down and out before I got in here. Who this is making me feel so fresh, so fresh. So if you guys are having problems with your levels, don't do what I do. <laughs> Do the good things that I do. Uh, don't do any of the bad. And then really boast up Michelangelo. Because he's, he's the best character. Really, he is. Because Mikey likes. Yeah. Yeah, come on. Take him down. That gold dude, though. That gold frog. That Genghis. Yeah. Big fan of that Genghis. Uh, I don't even really remember that episode. Because I think I watched... Uh, I think I, gotta, I think I watched about, like, half of it. I don't think I got the whole portion of that episode. Because where I watched that just wasn't a good version of it. So, uh, I need to watch the rest of that. Cause I don't think I good. I I don't think I could have got a. I could have got a good. Yeah. Tongue is, is crap now. <sighs> Tongue is crapping out. But thank you guys for otherwise watching this these episodes, cause I really appreciate it. Even if it probably seems like uh, there seems to be a mass amount of uh, let's just say a uh, very oddballish uh, oddballish like commentary that is going on uh, on certain things lately uh, for certain 
uh, videos, comments, it is what it is, but, uh, cause, yeah, evidently, uh, some people bizarrely latched, uh, some people, I say people cause I'm, uh, thinking they're beep boop beep beep boop boop, if you know what I mean, but, uh, yeah, so, Because I don't know why uh, every single one of these beep beep boop beep beep boop boop. Or ultimately, uh... <laughs> it's funny. It's funny. Uh, and especially when <laughs> I comment. Because everything that I say is not to uh, get back to these people. Everything is to usually uh, just make a joke within the comment section. Because ultimately, like, uh, they'll comment, they'll comment, like, some random, actually, or they'll, the random, they'll, like, say the same things over and over and over again, or they'll, um, they'll kind of have these, like, combination of words, and some, some of them are, are positive, which is great, because uh, it makes me quasi feel good, even though it probably is a very, uh, not real response. Uh, but hey, it makes, it kind of like, hey, great, like, I can get some positivity, uh, coming out of somewhere, but, but yeah, uh, ideally, uh, you get these kind of, uh, people that, uh, I make responses to, not to go with them out or whatever, uh, because I know better, uh, because Facebook uh, so evidently they're no longer doing it on Facebook, so now they're going on YouTube and doing it on YouTube now, where they're trying to, uh, get, uh, I don't know why they're going through this, through this, because, like, nobody is that naive enough, um, but who knows, maybe they'll, they'll, they'll just get people, but I take it as a joke, like, I, uh, for the most point, some of the un un unreal people. Uh, I just kind of make jokes about it, and ultimately, when they respond with something, uh, I'm not like going, "Oh yeah, I need to respond to this thing." No, everything that I try to do is a joke. Uh, so whenever any of these uh, things tend to res to write something, and I write back. Uh, there's one time where, like, somebody responded, like, some person responded to something, and I went beep boop beep boop, because I knew what it was, and so basically this person didn't respond back to what I had said before, and then just kept doing a, uh, another response that they had said previously at some other video, uh, so yeah, uh, make sure... Make sure that if you probably have somebody that is going to comment on your thing, um, that ultimately, uh, it's, it's great to have comments on a video, uh, cause video, uh, goes somewhere. So thanks for the comments, uh, whoever this person is, but at the end of the day, it just like really is like, Hey, thanks for helping the channel out <laughs> going in and, and viewing everything and then leaving a uh, a comment because uh, ultimately there's some people that are real and that's great uh, to get positive feedback um, but then again like after a while uh, you get to go oh yeah so you're one of those <laughs> you're one of those that have to um, like leave yeah uh, letting me know if storage is low on this. So, I'm gonna get out of here, because ultimately what I'm saying here is just absurdity. Uh, but if you're real, thank you for being here. If you're a bot, thank you as well! Because, <laughs> either way, uh, it comes up as a view, it comes up as a like, it comes up as a, uh, comment. So, uh, thanks for helping out this channel. Uh, ultimately, if uh, this entire channel is, uh, was very much bots coming on here and whatever. 
uh, that's great because it uh, gets me to uh, monetizational goals. So that's that's great. So hopefully uh, we can uh, you can keep commenting and I can keep uh, going. Okay, hey my my uh, my things are going really well. And I don't know why, but hey, great for that. <laughs> Uh, thanks everybody. And if you're not a, and if you're not a bot, be boo boop boo boo. If, if you know, <laughs> if you're not a bot, be boo boop boo 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 boo. Eh? So I'm going to get out of here. Bye everybody. Bye everybody.